Smoko check level three, day 39. Thanks to my lovely wife, the ubiquitous raspberry bun, buttered with English breakfast tea in the polka dot cup. Bloody marvelous. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hi, Pi. I hope you've had a bloody marvelous day. I was having a fairly busy day and my lovely wife noticed it and uh, she was out doing a bit of shopping, bought home some Smoko. These raspberry buttons, very uh, common in most uh, supermarkets and things in New Zealand, but fresh and uh, yeah, very, very tasty. An early start today with an eight o'clock class and we got that done, at, well, got through till nine o'clock and then uh, a meeting started. We had a, a meeting um, and my students dropped in and done everything they needed. So I was able to attend the meeting and it was about how we're going to deal with our online exams and how to set them up and things like that. So that was um, pretty informative and uh, yeah, went pretty well. Got to know um, what it is that um, I'm going to be doing uh, when I invigilate i've got three to invigilate so we've got to set them up they're going to be done on zoom and that and that so um that's going to take a little bit of time so we went through um the procedures and that and uh, reasonably straightforward and within the uh, realm of my current skill set so yeah and then i had another class um which sort of started at 12 so my lovely wife sort of noticed, I think, that I was didn't have much time to do anything. So went out, and there was these raspberry buns, the ubiquitous raspberry bun that, um, yeah, is available in most supermarkets. New Zealand, a bit of butter on them and a cup of tea. They're um, very sweet. I think um, I had two on the plate there. I think one might have been enough. I should have... Uh, just uh, stuck with the one, but I managed the two and then I cut back in other areas. So hopefully my intake's, um, you know, stable and steady. And uh, then I just needed a, I needed some exercise. I'd had enough. It was the end of the week. I was a little bit tired and um, just wanted to get out there. So I got the mower out and fortunately I had enough petrol. Um, I was a bit worried I might, um, you know, run out halfway through. But, uh, yeah, out with the mower. I did have to stop halfway. It was quite heavy work, as I predicted with the long grass and things. And then it was just a matter of um, putting the mower away and, uh, yeah, coming inside and settling down at the end of another bloody marvellous day. So that was uh, side one that was mowed and two, two, five, six steps. That's, uh, that's good. Not pretty good for, um, in, under current circumstances. The old bun fight. Yeah, the, the end of the year, end of the season thing down at the rugby gym. Dad used to call it the bun fight. I, I looked it up. It is actually a, a word for an afternoon tea um, sort of thing. But yeah, he always called it oh, the bun fight. Yes, I always remember that. Uh, right, and uh, six hours of teaching, two hours of admin, and uh, wait. I, I didn't weigh myself. I didn't have time this morning. Yes, and what sport would you most likely witness a face plant? Answers in the comments below the video, please. It was Howie who was first in with yesterday's uh, correct uh, comment and was able to uh, make the comments uh, stick in the comment section without disappearing. Bloody marvellous. In fact, I was not aware of any undisclosed comments yesterday, but hmm, I couldn't maybe incorrect on that. Anyway, thanks to everyone for your support. As I say, you're all bloody marvellous. Cheers. Feel legit. This has been a Mario presentation, recorded live in our studio at Narawahia, Aotearoa, New Zealand, the land of the long white cloud, a place where Kiwis live in a paradise we like to call God's own country.